Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm just going to give you a quick tip on how you can use your tripod as a steady cam, or two ways you can use it as a shoulder rig for uh, your video camera or DSLR if you're shooting handheld and want a bit more stability. So the first thing we'll do is a steady cam. As you'll see on this tripod, I have the legs slightly extended. This tripod does have a hook for a counterweight for when it's windy, and you can add a little bit of weight to that if you want to. But for this way you won't need to, so I've mounted my camera on the top. All I'm going to do is I'm going to take the tilt arm and tilt it towards the handle of my tripod. Now some tripods don't have a handle. For my version it'll be a handle or you could potentially hold the inner support of the tripod. But having a handle makes it much easier for this. And then you're going to lift it up by the handle, close the legs down so that they make one smooth surface. Put my elbow against it. And that gives you a lot of a steadier shot. It's not the same as most uh, steady cams which have a counter weight thing, but if you use two hands, if you're walking around, this does give you a much more smooth video, less shake. So that's the steady cam version. And the next idea is that you just use the tilt arm again, but you put it in your collarbone here or on your shoulder, depending how big that arm is. And uh, if I shrink the legs down on the tripod, just like this, I can hold the front leg through the middle of the tripod or round the side, and I can put the closest leg to my inners right on my stomach. I flip the screen out of my camera. If you don't have a flip out screen, it is a bit uncomfortable to look at the back of your DSLR. So if you're using this with a video camera with a flip out screen, it's perfect. Now that's better if you're shooting some kind of um, speech scene, a conversation where you're standing still but you still want that handheld look, looking over someone's shoulder for example. This is best, it's not great if you're walking around. If you want to walk around and shoot, all you have to do here is flip your camera so that it is lenses over the tilt arm of your tripod and then the tilt arm is over the handle. You don't have to have a handle, but if you do, this is the best way to do it. And tilt it away so that your camera is looking straight up into the sky. Pick it up, again, close the legs, and then hold it on your shoulder, just like that. Very much like a proper shoulder rig. You can add a, a sandbag or some kind of weight to the back of here if you like. Um, it doesn't require much weight, um, so if you just want to hang your regular rucksack, you can carry stuff into the hook. You can do that, but I've found that just doing that gives you the extra stability you need for more handheld work if you can't afford a steady cam or a shoulder rig like I can't. If this video has helped you out, please hit the like button, hit the dislike button if you didn't like it, but do write a comment below to let me know what I can do to improve my videos. If you're not subscribed already, make sure you subscribe to be kept up to date with all my videos. Thank you once again for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. I'd just like to take a minute to thank you for watching my video. If you've made it this far, you're almost at the end. But there are a few things I'd really appreciate you do, and they'll only take you a few seconds. So firstly, check out the video description to this video and my other videos. There are tons of great links down there, including a link to Amazon. Now basically, if you use my Amazon link when you buy things through Amazon, it means I get a tiny commission based on your sale. I've also created a new campaign through patreon.com forward slash George Slade. Now my Patreon is slightly different to others you may have seen on the internet. Most Patreons have a tier level, you donate more, you get better rewards. Whereas mine doesn't. I simply have one tier, and that is that you pledge $2 a month to help grow this channel. Now you may be thinking, why should I pledge my hard-earned money to help this guy out? Well basically, any money that comes in through the Amazon link or through the Patreon goes straight back into this channel in two ways. The first is it allows me to improve the gear I'm using to make better quality videos for you. I can buy or I can rent things that I wouldn't normally afford just to bring extra quality to this channel. And two, it allows me to go out and buy things that I think you guys would want, which I can then give away on this channel. Also, come and check out my social media, because I really appreciate everybody who watched my video. I have Twitter, Instagram, and Flickr, and you can see some more of my stuff on there. Again, thank you so much for watching my videos. Seeing the views, the subscribers, and the comments go up, and replying and interacting with you guys is absolutely fantastic. So, and I really appreciate it.